Alright guys, I got a treat for you. So uh, I have a friend that gave me some uh, farmed beets, as you can see. They're not from Sobeys, it's just used to bag. Uh, and then uh, some carrots, as you can see, fresh with dirt and things like that. So I'm going to cook them up, uh, and then I'll show you what it looks like. I'm going to be cooking them up in my rice cooker, and then I'll do a quick taste test. So stay tuned, guys. And I also got some peas too, which I'm going to be putting in as well. So stay tuned. Okay, right, so this is what it looks like once it's uh, all cut up. So here are the beets. Uh, the, the carrots, I'm going to uh, tell you, it has a nice aroma to it, like a really strong carrot smell to it. Uh, the beets, also the same, a little bit earthy. It's normal. So uh, I'm going to cook it up, then I'll show you what it looks like. Stay tuned, right, guys. So these are those farmed uh, peas that I told you guys about. See how plump they are? They're, they look totally different. Um, so I'm going to be putting that in my rice, and uh, yeah, I'll show you guys right here right into the instant pot we see the carrots in there as well uh, so i'm going to cook it up and i'll do a quick taste test once it's done stay tuned guys all right so the veggies are all done so we're gonna take a do a quick taste test right there the peas are awesome it's got a lot of flavor the rice is really good has a lot of flavor as well you get to you get the vegetables melded in there uh, definitely check it out guys, uh, if you have any questions, comments, post below, subscribe to the channel. And then now I would put in some like organic grill super greens and some meat and some other stuff. So uh, if you already cook your meat, you can always slice it in as well. Stay tuned for more recipes.